Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. It is about time that the Golden Knights begin their revenge tour against the Seattle Kraken, who were the team that put us out in last year's playoffs. I think it was a sweep too. We might have taken one game from them, but I'm trying to recall, I think it was a sweep, so that got ugly. So obviously this year, we want to take them down and get our revenge. I think last year as well, we were fourth and fifth in the league this time. Was it second and third last year? I don't know, but 87 overall, how about that? Let's also do a quick rundown of the lines again, see if we have any injuries, stuff like that. So we will go to the view line screen and see that we got Willie K playing with Nate Mack and Mark Stone, Arvidsson with Eichel and Kopp. So our top six is very good. Bottom six, well, not so much, but I think they could get the job done, especially with your boy in net. Defensively, we've got Ghost playing with White Cloud, which means... Pi Trangelo is injured. Yep, there he is. 88 overall, five abilities, and he's not playing. But thankfully, we do have TJ. Yeah, hopefully can steal the show. Without further ado, let's get this party started. The Seattle Kraken, the Golden Knights, the year four playoffs are here. First period, not great. Pass the scores on the power play. Second period, well, we're gonna jump in, but it's not looking good. The only time I've seen our team score more than two goals in a single period was when there was an empty net. So I really don't like our chances here. Also, they somehow have Marshallon and they also have Crosby. What's up with that? It looks like the simulation is once again not gonna treat us very well against this team. But again, this is only the first game, so we can't really jump to any conclusions just yet. But we will have a fair amount of the series done in this video, three games. And I think we should likely have to win the next two if we want to stand a chance. Well, you know what? That's not fully true. I'll take anything that isn't 3-0. Nice save. That was a good pass and a good shot as well. We're moving the puck here. Love to see it. We just can't let their goalie get a shutout, you know? That'd be the ultimate confidence booster that we are... <laughs> Not willing to hand out right now. It's the first game of the series, guys. I just realized that because we have Nate Mack, it's all three of the big Scotia boys. We've got past No, not Pasta. He is not from Nova Scotia. I just saw him coming in, and then my brain immediately went to that. But no, we've got Crosby, Marshawn, and Nate Mack all playing on the ice at the same time. We do still have 13 minutes remaining, but I don't know. Three goals is a tall task. Nice hit. I like it. Let's get some physicality going here. If we can't beat them on the scoreboard in game one, then let's at least rough them up a little bit, you know? Goche's in over the line. He gets pinned. Eichel trying to battle Matty Beneers for it, but Beneers will come out on top. And now Jared McCann tries to come across the line. Eichel gets rocked, but that will give us a power play that might be able to bring us back into this thing. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And slowly but surely, it does arrive. I will go around the boards. Our defenseman, that wasn't even our defenseman, actually. That was Cop. He just looked at the puck, watched it go around the boards, and decided he didn't want to touch it. Ooh, would I have gotten an assist there? No, I think there was two other players, but anyway, that was close. Eight and a half remaining. We just gave up the puck in our zone while we're on the power play. Don't love to see that, but we're back on the attack here. Another great save, and the puck is coming right back down again. Come on, Knights. This isn't how I want our journey to end. I would much rather at least make it past the Seattle Kraken. I'm not even asking for the Stanley Cup. I just want to get past these guys. Let's go, Ghost. Nice pass. Cross the ice, and then he does that. Almost forces an offside. Liam is in. He goes down low. What a pass. I don't even know if the goalie got a piece of that or if that went off our own player. Because to me, it looks like it went off who was ever in front of the net there, but I totally could have seen that wrong because it happened real quick. Cop, nice. Oh! All right, I know what I gotta do. I know what I gotta do. Nice try, Liam. Don't you dare get a whistle. Nope, we're going. Drop the mitts. Who is it even? Oh, it's Philly Huso. All right, here we go. The refs are freaking out. Boom, and boom. Oh, not a good start for you, Philly, that's for sure. And throw one. You won't. Do it again. I wanna try getting the hook, but I feel like it just doesn't happen. Throw another one. Okay, well, there it is. And, oh, he actually connected. Ow, my chin. <laughs> no, you can't hook anymore, I swear. It's impossible. Sit down, Philly. That's what you get. Come on, boys. Let's go here. Win the draw. 
Willie K, clean, back to 1-4. All right. Nice save off of the Matty Beneers shot. And we are headed back the other way. Here goes Ghost, who, by the way, I feel like he's been one of the most noticeable players out there. Great trade deadline acquisition. Another great save as well by Vili Husso. Val goes cross ice, and that will be saved. I'm throwing it out. I don't care. We got to get some momentum going here if we want to stand a chance. It is the final minute, though, so I think we're kind of done here. Like I said, just don't want their goalie to get a shutout. That's all I'm really asking for in this one. I don't think that's unreasonable. You know, that's a pretty fair request, in my opinion. Boom! Off the blocker from a Nichushkin slap shot. And we have not much time remaining. I don't think we're going to break the shutout. It's 10 seconds, and we coughed it up immediately after entering their zone. Okay, we, we might get one more shot, though. Tim Winston goes for the deke. Nope. That's it. Game over. All right, not the way we wanted to start the series, but what is going on? Nice little 29 save shutout from Villy. Unbelievable, guys. Yeah, you better look upset. That was pathetic. Absolutely brutal. We gotta step it up. An 884 save percentage? No. I simply will not stand for this. All right, couple deep breaths. Let's jump in and hope that this simulation treats us just a little bit better. You know, a little tiny bit. Not asking for a lot here. Let's get a goal on Villy and the floodgates will open. First period. Nice. There we go, Achari and Fisher. Just have a half decent second period. That's all I ask. That's more than half decent. That's great. How the turntables. We are now the team up by three in the third period. And the other netminder currently has the goose egg. Not a big deal. Here comes Bradley. Ooh, a little scared there, are we? Turns back. He does end up making a great pass, though. I guess Brad just wanted to be with Pasta. So they reunited. And let's go Golden Knights. We've already had one kind of close chance. But let's see if we can get another one here. I like it. Get it down low. Passes there for it, though. Swings it up to Connor, who was doing really well in the points. He wasn't the one that won the Art Ross, though, was he? He actually might have been. No, I don't think so. But I do remember him doing very well. Nice save again. Pasta goes for a shot. Only one person kind of screening there, but it was easy enough to see. Brad in the corner. Nice. Coming to help your teammate. I love it. White Cloud is there. Oh, we still don't have Petrangelo, do we? Okay, we got to get that man's back. I think I asked this before, but I wonder if there's a way for us to view the injury report to see how long he's supposed to be out for. No way, Villy, man. Chill out. Let us get a goal that I actually witness. So that way, I can see that you are, in fact, human. What is this guy on right now? I guess, to be fair, he's not human. <laughs> he is an AI, so... Yeah, never mind. Take back what I said. Just under 12 minutes to go here. There has been a few chances at each end, but nothing too crazy. Here's Tim Winston carrying it up the ice. And he's going to gain the blue line himself. Tries to take a shot, but we double teamed him there. Poke checked it away. And now William Carlson. I thought he was about to get rocked, but he actually firmed it. Stone! What a goal! No way! That was a thing of beauty. That was absolutely phenomenal. And I would love to see the replay, if you don't mind. Yeah, celebrate. That's a 4-0 lead, too. So this is a dominant performance from the Golden Knights. And a big bounce back that we needed. Because after being shut out in game number one. And, you know, they're already rent-free in our head from last year. And we're headed to the power play. Fire me vertical. David Pasta. Going off. Two minutes for tripping. Edmondson just skates it right up the center of the ice. And we are showing no signs of urgency to stop him. I don't know what that was all about. Especially considering we are in fact on the power play. There we go. What a lovely goal. This is a absolutely incredible performance from the Golden Knights right now. I haven't even seen this before. Goche gets a pass. Walks right in. Dangles past one guy and buries it. Beautiful guys. Oh, Marchi gets dropped. We are all over this team right now in every single department. And I'm here for it. Nice try. We take that. Jones makes a pass in the middle to Bedard, who has nowhere to go with it. We're shutting them down entirely. Cam Fowler gains the line. 
and goes for a pass and we're all over it. We're just there, okay? We are. Eichel headed to the sin bin for two minutes and we will have to kill this penalty, but we are up 5-0. So, you know, I'm not too worried right now. They would more or less need a goal per minute and I just simply do not foresee that happening. Connor, what do you think you're doing? And can we get this puck off of this man, please? I remember I had the logic of basically never hug the post. Like, things like this, I don't want to because stuff like that happens. And, you know, if I was hugging the post, you would have had the whole other side of the net open. But there's certainly situations where hugging the post does have its benefits and pay off. And that Bedard up close and personal was one of them. Pass down low to Fowler who tries to go high blocker. And we are all over that. Another chance up close. Smother that. I tried to pass it out. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh my word. My heart just stopped. Even though it's 5 nothing, you know? It's still stressful. This was absolutely a performance that we needed. Because, like I said, last year they put us out. First game of this year, they shut us out. And we just basically came back and said, screw you. We can, in fact, destroy you, and we will. Do the arena people for the Golden Knights still say, It's night time! Because if so, that's gonna be my new thing. Yeah, let's go. Don't even try to score. The shutout is happening, and there's nothing you can do about it. Sydney, no. Goes over to Val, who tries to take a shot, but our defense shut that opportunity down as well. We're just playing well as a cohesive unit right now. You know, everybody's doing their part, and that is a... Well-deserved and much-needed win from your Golden Knights. Holy crap, they had 40 shots? Well, that's a save percentage redeemer if I've ever seen one. Our save percentage went up to a 954. Holy smokes. I'm gonna try to see if there is a way to see how long Petrangelo is out for, but I'm not really seeing anything just yet. You know what I am gonna do, though? Salary perks. 3.3 milli. We need one more X-Factor point, and we can add another ability. So, hopefully, we can afford something. This is a permanent perk, and we get 5,000 social media followers. Plus two X-Factor points. Purchase that. Designer Furniture also gives us a plus one in trade points. Which, wait, that's trade points. I don't care about trade points. I want X-Factor. I don't know why I find that so funny. Insufficient followers. <laughs> You know, I would be your chef, but you just don't have enough followers. I'm sorry. I could start a clothing brand that also sells iPads, apparently. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. And then I can also get into the stock market. Oh, wait, that only lasts for 20 days? It does give you an X-Factor point. There's no way they can take that X-Factor point back, can they? I guess we just need more followers. To unlock this slot, you will need to acquire X-Factor points via short and long-term challenges with the media management or your teammates. Five out of three X pack. How do I unlock it then? You know what sucks too is that people are going to be telling me in this video how to unlock it. And I'll probably have recorded like 92 more episodes by then. I can't really find a way to see how long he's going to be out for. But he's still gone. We need you, Alex. Anyway, let's go ahead, play game number three. And we will be in the desert this time. Sim game. Hopefully, it's a good one. First period. That's fine. All day, I'll take that. Second period. All right, we've got ourselves a contest. Let's go, let's go. The crowd getting behind the lads here. We got a go Knights go chant to start period numero trois. And we have a tied hockey game nonetheless at two goals a piece. Did not look at shots, but I know that after the first period it was like 12, 11 or something like that. So I'm assuming both teams have over 20 shots, but that is a bold assumption. Oh my word. What a save. That sets the tone. It was pasta too, you know? That guy's got an X Factor, some ability sprinkled in there, and still got absolutely annihilated on the one timer. Nate Mack takes a penalty, and now we are going to have to attempt to kill this thing off. Hopefully, we succeed. Bordalo sends it down the ice, and that will kill off a decent chunk. Here's Pasta, who manages to get past the defense with not even relative ease. Like, that was just super easy. Horrendous pass on my part. But I'm just going to try to ignore that and pretend it did not happen. Yes? Nate Mack was right there. Their defense reached out for it, and he just saved a goal. Without a doubt. But can we get one still... So close. Holy. 
We're putting on a lot of pressure right now. They're stressed. Huso doesn't even cover it. What an absolute mad lad. No way. Two big saves. First point shot tip. And then up close and personal. That I'm, I know. I'm not going to pass it out this time. It is about time that I settled it down just a little bit. Oh, I was so confused. I thought the face-off went to the other end, but no, I was just showing it from the Seattle Kraken zone. Big draw win, Nate. Nope. He's going to lose it. Fowler takes a shot. I slid way too far there, but thankfully, our defense bailed me out. Slap shot kicked away. Nate Mack had it for a hot minute, but it was taken from him. He does end up getting it back in the corner, though, and he is blazing up the ice. Gets it to Vicky. Back to Nate. Ooh, okay. All right. I like it. It was a good little rush. Val Nichushkin headed back this way now. Goes across to Sydney the Kidney, who tries going high glove. That will be saved by TJ and passed out, because of course it will. I don't know why, but this game just feels super long. The fact that there's still nine minutes left is mind-blowing for me. It's been very fast-paced, though, so maybe that's why. It feels like there's been a lot more going on in a short period of time compared to other games. No way! Did Vili Husso get a piece of that, or did we just hit the side of the net? I didn't really get a good enough picture. <laughs> yeah, I was just over here with my Nikon taking pictures. What I really meant to say is, let's go! <laughs> Liam! Gonna snipe it! I was gonna say I didn't have a good enough view, but for some reason I said picture. I have no idea where that came from. Absolutely out of left field. But so did this goal! Breaks past the defender, and what a shot. Vili Husso gets beat on the blocker. The Golden Knights are now up by one with only six minutes to go. If we could go up 2-1 in this series, that would be absolutely massive. So I'm really hoping that we can shut her down over the next five minutes and head to our second home game up by one. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Pasta just got Beybladed. That was a massive hit. Good stuff. I love the way we're playing right now. You're joking. I can't get over how well we're playing right now. Like, this is actually outrageous. Splendid pass. Tremendous tip in from Nate. All around. Wonderful. Look at this. The pass of a beautician. And he just taps it in. Just tap it in. Tap, tap, tappy. Through a crowd, that will be saved. And I was actually about to, you know, throw that thing out to the left. But the way that TJ was positioned, I did not envision that ending well whatsoever. So I managed to dig deep, find the restraint, and not do it. Can we get a clean draw win here? Yes, we can. Jack. Ooh, Nachushkin. Let's a wrister go. And thankfully, my positioning was at least okay enough that I was able to get a blocker on it. They are flying out here right now, though. Not going down easy, that's for sure. Nice. Ooh, I love that play. That was huge. Jack managed to muscle past the D-man and then get it over. The shot, not so great. But how about that save from TJ? Bedard decides to T1 up from the dot. And a big blocker save. Made with relative ease. Net's empty, Stone. Net's empty! Big miss. Unless he was aiming for the Bauer logo, then I don't think you hit your target, my guy. Here come the Kraken. Pasta in the middle. Put that in the glove. No way. Dude, they were swarming the front of the net. They've studied tape. They know that I like to pass it out. Oh, no. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Mm -mm. Nope. Not today. I was holding it. And I was not about to let go. Another save. Smother it. Throw it out there. Yes, it kind of worked. Crosby did get his twig on it momentarily, but not enough. And an empty netter just for icing on the cake. That's a massive dub. After being down 1-0 in the series and a shutout nonetheless, we rally back. And now we have the one game series lead. They put up 40 shots again. TJ's out of control. Somebody must put a stop to this outrageous man. Team plays yellow, get real. Who do you think you are? Not that I care, you know, just saying, just saying. 
Sim to next game. And we have ourselves a 2-1 series lead. The next video will be massive. Playing three games, so we could win the series in that one. We could also let the Kraken win three in a row and get put out. Hopefully that doesn't happen. One new slot unlock available. So now it's just letting me? Yeah. What the heck? Why would- why did it not let me before? I could do the poke check one, or I could do light work when facing wrist shots. I think that's the one I want. Yeah, that seems cool. All right, we now have two abilities. Not only are we already insane, but we've just added another weapon to our arsenal. I'll go ahead and show the playoff tree so we can get an update there. No one has a series with zero dubs. So there's not going to be any sweeps in round one. How are the boys doing? Nate Mac, five points in three games. And then we have four point-of-game players. Achari, Stone, Goche, and Carlson. Nice. Where's Eichel? Why is this guy struggling so... Don't tell me. Jack. We gotta have a talk. How about this guy, eh? 952, 167. That is just a little bit crazy. Not a lot. No, you know what? It's quite crazy. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, we have the series lead over the Seattle Kraken, who won five straight playoff games against us because they swept us last year, beat us in the first game this year, but then we fought back, and now we have a 2-1 series lead. So, hopefully, we can keep this momentum going into the next video, put out the Seattle Kraken, but only time will tell. On that note, I'll see you soon.